as part of the new functionality available in Helios Composite Pro 4.2 is the ability to export material data defined for either a composite lamina or a composite laminate into a text file that will be able to be used in a finite element analysis. To use this tool, we can select the export material from the utilities menu and we have the ability to export both lamina such as this IM78552 material that I have defined over here on the left or laminate material data such as this quasi-isotropic composite laminate I have created using this IM78552 ply material. When exporting laminate material data the actual composite layup is not exported, but instead the 3D orthotropic material properties that are calculated for that composite laminate are exported. There are multiple software packages that we are able to export this material data to, including Abacus, Ansys, and Nasdran. And within each software package, we have the ability to export the material data as both engineering constants, so our Young's moduli, our shear moduli, and our Poisson ratios, or the an anisotropic elastic uh, material constants for an orthotropic stiffness matrix. In ANSYS, we have the ability to export material data for both the classic ANSYS APDL or the newer MATML 3.1 uh, format that is able to be imported into ANSYS Workbench. And for NASTRAN, we have multiple ways of exporting this material data available as different material cards for use, use in a NASTRAN input file. As an example of how to use this material data, we can click on the Show Output button and for an abacus engineering constant laminate, what I have shown here is the engineering constants that are associated with this composite laminate. Um, if I had uh, thermal expansion coefficients defined, they would be input here, and then also the density is input. And for those of you familiar with abacus, um, this is just a commented region. And what this is, is it's simply a description of the laminate that the properties are defined for. And when we are ready to use these material data files uh, in our finite element analysis, we can either do a copy and paste by selecting the material and doing a control C and then control V to paste it into our input file. We can copy this to a clipboard and paste it into an input file. And then we also have the ability to create a new text file or append to an existing text file this material property data set that we can use in an abacus uh, finite element analysis.